All right. So. All right. So. so yeah. Uh. So 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 I'm gonna go do this fast. I don't know if this. Uh, it's turning stuff. I guess this will probably not be everything locked from the beginning, so I'll leave it for afterwards. Right now, let's continue this side quest. Uh, since this is a continuation of Golden Slumber, it may take a while to complete it. It may be a bit long. But it should give me the rest. Keep up curious that I need. Oh, there's a girl there. Those people are back there. There's this girl here again with the tango flowers and stuff. Okay, but let's continue that one. What's taking them so long? Mm, Palantari. Hmm. That voice sounds really familiar. Voluntary, I didn't expect you to sneak all the way to our village. This old bag of bones is going to fall apart chasing after you, you know? Ah, uh, it's Mr. Soheyu. Someone at your age should be reading a few texts and recorded in the academia. What are you doing all the way out here? Well, you know, I never saw... I've never seen an old person in the academia, have we? Yo, this was probably the green sage there. Um, what am I doing here? I'm here to stop you youngsters from running off into the desert, of course. All of you have read quite a few papers, and yet you can't keep your cool. There is a gain some success once, and you all go charging into the desert like mindless fungi. Uh, the sage is afraid you will learn the matra and worried that you might damage the ruins. So I was sent to dissuade all of you. So there are more. All of us. Um, but I came alone and I even especially applied for paid leave to keep it a secret from everyone else. You did come here alone, but you are not the only one with the same idea. Do you know how many have how many leave applications the sage received yesterday? 46. A total of 46 applications. All of them from young students wanting to try their luck after reading that paper. They gave all sorts of excuses. Helping a neighbor was house caught on fire, a fungi invasion turning their homes upside down, accidentally consuming spoiled curry, if only they use their creativity on writing papers, could it just be a coincidence? No, what a vast assortment of excuses. And that's exactly why you should trust them. As they say, the absurdity of the truth often exceeds the, any researcher's imagination. Besides, I haven't seen any other researcher here in our village, so there's a high chance they were all telling the truth. Of course you didn't. I have already convinced all 45 of them to go back while on my way here. You are the last one. Listen, academic research never relies on luck. Their Zen may have produced a well-written paper, but we still haven't verified its credibility. But I found a guide. No buts. Having no prior experience is enough to get you lost in the desert, even if it didn't if you don't get lost, there's no guarantees you won't accidentally damage something within the rooms. For the sake of your safety and the rooms, you must head back. If you refuse, I'll have to ask Hawani from the Corp 30 to escort you back. Well, isn't he on a paid leave? can he just wander anywhere he wants? Right now? Please head back. Alright. That's how a researcher of the academy should act. Alright, off you go. Uh, Mr. Sohel, you're not going back? Of course not. I'll be staying here for some time to stop other rash researchers like you from entering the desert. It's not, I'm not rash. 
I'm just in need of inspiration for my paper. I thought I finally had my chance. Goodbye, traveler, and maybe meet again. Safe travels. It looks really sad. There goes our morgue. No, we didn't get our free food. I didn't even remember he offered free food. So. Do you now no. understand how wrong you were? Yes. You were right. Sorry, I was so busy with Kalantari that I didn't get to greet you. I'm Sohil from the Uzai, Uzaibia family and a researcher from Vahumana. But, um, did he plan to hire you as his guide? In that case, I'm sorry for running your business. Uh, but it may not be a bad thing. Tirzat's paper isn't very credible, so you might have ended up going all the way for nothing. Oh, I believe him. Oh, why are you so sure? Wait, are you the ones mentioning his acknowledgements? Oh, blooming flowers, bread and salt. Gift from the desert, shrink that was. Yes, that's us. We are the thing in the Zephyrmon, the travelers who went on an expedition with Tirzat. Oh, well, being willing to support your employer is a good thing, I suppose. Uh, it shows that you value contracts just as the people of Leo do. But you can't fool me. I didn't actually have a contract. Uh, I've been to the desert in my youth. But I have never once encountered places like the Kemeno Temple or Kaj. Uh, it's, I think it's Kai Nisut. And I was probably saying Kaj Nisut. Mentioned in the paper. Besides that, the sandstorm at the top of the mausoleum of King Deshart is still as I remember it from my youth. So I suspect that Tears had never entered the mausoleum of King Deathstroke. He probably made it all up. Oh yes. What's up with that storm over there? Are we going to turn it off or somehow? Or something? I'm fairly certain you took his mora and got your story straight so that when someone comes check, his papers will seem more credible. Don't we have some evidence? Well, shouldn't he need to bring some evidence with him? For publishing the paper. It might have been a good plan, but unfortunately you ran to me. That's not the kind of person he is. We're not like that. Well, I certainly believe that you are not easily tempted by Mora, so Teresa must have made an offer that you couldn't refuse. I've seen many researchers who would stop at nothing just to complete their papers. Anyway, you're free to go. I won't pursue the matter. Just don't help him write fake. Don't help him write fake th thesis anymore. <laughs> Please leave. Uh, Spam so peeved. Spam could sense him looking down on us beneath that polite tone. He even said that about Tirzad. That was so mu too much. He's saying we faked it just because he couldn't find a way into the ruins himself. Oh, have been taking care of the stone slate there's a left with us. It's right here. Perfect, that's an important piece of evidence. Uh, wait a minute. The symbol at its center has lit up and it's pointing somewhere. Oh, that didn't... It's probably because of Kainisut. It's probably because we finished King Deshret's trial. Mm, you're right. In that case... We might be able to enter the depths of the ruins now. You know the place we couldn't enter before? No, I don't remember. Or talk about places with clearance that I've checked already. Let's go and take a look. If we find any solid evidence, the researcher will have no choice but to apologize to Tirzat and us. Well, we made kind of appear. Isn't that uh, evidence enough? Uh, if I read further in, Scarlet Sense Lady will progressively display key locations for how the ruins. Oh, 
I've been using the map off screen to get chests and stuff. This would probably have helped. Uh, I got some more clears, but I we can get to the maximum apparently without this quest. Follow this late guidance and use special clears to unlock these devices, and you may yet reach places that none before you have. Well, people who build it have. Sleep. Don't do anything unnecessary. Uh, we're still in a village. Are you thinking about trying to get something from me? Just give up on that. I'm not Jason, Kalantari, or any of those other youngsters. I never try to take the easy way out. Allow me to guide you to the right path. Start gaining knowledge now. Who knows, you might even make it into the academia once you reach my age. Oh, okay. you were right. Where's the place indicated in the Oh here? Oh, okay, didn't have that. Those are just like okay, I went there. Oh, I don't think I did a point here. At least it didn't look like that. Um, uh, so that now. Okay, huh? you kidding? Okay, go. All right. Um, I think this is on the ground. Ah, I couldn't enter here. Okay, now I can. Yeah, I don't even quite remember how to get here. I guess I was following the path underneath the temple. No, actually, I think it was from this one going forward, not here. Ah, uh, of the stone slate, we arrive at our destination. It's just that Paimon doesn't see any special devices. Even though we're definitely inside the mausoleum now. Uh, have we gone the wrong way? Should we have another look at the stone slate? Uh, there's no writing on it. And three dots of light. The mortal plane is like a river between the other world and the arrow. Mortals must not cross, must not probe, must not, uh, must not, Paimon doesn't know how to read that. Or they shall descend into the other world forever. In order to ascend to arrow, one must have a body like that of a vulture and soar above the underworld. Back at three different organs, in order to obtain the consent of Awakma and fly across the river in the form of the falcon. The word is covet. Oh, must not covet. But what does that mean? This all sounds pretty important, but Paimon doesn't understand anything. Which one do you think is more important? Uh, Orange was saying, back three different organs, back three different organs. Back out three different, uh, back out three organ types. Do we really have to eat organs? That's scary. She eats everything. She eats a bunch of meat. Um, if we sum it all up, we must do something to the organs to open a new path that leads to our room. Um, it sounds kind of like mysterious. But speaking of organs, my things, we've heard that one somewhere. We did. Did you mention it? I've forgotten. Mm -hmm. Um, Pamela remembers now. Jirza made us go to some hall used to store organs, didn't he? Did he? The boat? 
that's the only different hall I remember. Different room I remember. He was so stubborn then. Uh, oh, okay, okay, yeah, the, the tomb. Okay, that tomb, he said that. Uh, he wouldn't listen to anyone and insist that King Dashford's legacy had to be in King Dash Dashford's mausoleum. Then he found a strange device. But in the end, it was wise old Paimon who discovered the link between the stone slate and the strange device and made the symbol on the stone slate go click and light up. Was it her? It wasn't her. Sounds like I might have embellished things a little. Only a little. Anyway, the organs are the important part. Let's not dwell on these details. Maybe back at three different organs refer to finding three devices just like before. And then we'll get to that place called Aru. Let's go. Let's see what secrets King Dashard has been hiding in Aru. Still, Pyle thinks that those three dots of light on the stone slate include places we have been to. Their symbols have lit up to. Uh, great. Just thinking about going to three separate places made Pyle tired, but. It looks like we have to find one more device. Paimon is so grateful to pass Paimon. Um, be grateful to me too. Okay, so she just mentioned that because I got the clearance already. Otherwise I will have to leave and get that. Alright, thank you. Uh, let's go look for the remaining devices. I don't quite remember where one of those were. We had one from the quest. The other one I got come entering here, I guess, and the exit's there. Then inside here we can get one. The other was around here somewhere, the underground, after entering from there. But we still need another clearance that I don't know where I can get. Uh, this one, I'm pretty sure I got. This one, I don't think I did. I don't remember one with that much water. This one, I guess I did. It's there as well. And then this one. The value of knowledge cannot simply be mm. quantified in monetary terms. Oh no, well, this lives here. Oh, I'm not reading all that. The best thing for press is trial. Should I prepare for the thirst? Okay, okay. I better open a map so I'll, I'll mark things. No, probably chests and things along the way. I almost got everything on the desert. It's mostly those things I'm missing. Okay, I don't think this one will stop. Ah, I follow it the did. wind. Okay. Yeah. 
stabilize. <laughs> Can't see. Wind strider. As one with wind and cloud. Who says there aren't benefits to a life of wandering? Time to go. What a mess. Why don't we start in all of the hamster? So I'm just falling. So I don't need to use Algebra's help. Singles. Are you going there as well? Okay. Time to go. Oh, it's over there. Okay, so I'm missing one. Oh, no, no. one's lit already. Okay, so can I just complete? Okay, I'm dropping a bunch of frames. We probably lagged while I was falling them. So, we're done. Except for the abandoned yet nostalgic ancient city that there's no longer hides in secrets. Okay, here now. It's nearby too. Okay. Anything around here? Uh -oh. Time to 
Time to go. No, I can't enter there. Hang on. Let's check here. Oh. Uh, okay, maybe they will <laughs> open the door. Oh, shoes. Uh, there should be another one here. There are leaves around, and I know just the tune to accompany them, if you wish to hear it. Okay, there'll be another chest Time to go. after. I will have order. I hear everything. In crowd. Stabilize. Wind strider. I'll uproot you. Fallen leaves. Adorn my order guide you. Just left and on the return. Kind of pointless. Why not just make the fight here? There aren't benefits to a life of wandering. All right. No. Same thing. Time to go. Step here. Okay, I can't. Mm, hang on, let's see. Yeah. I'm supposed to follow you. All right. I'm not gonna risk it. Oh, 
big deal there's a path over there. This is much safer. A fateful offering. Okay, now let's go up there. This whole room just for that. Not a vein, too. Time to go. Mm, I has been thinking for a while now. This place feels really important. It's like Storm Tower's lair, but in the desert. Okay, okay. Uh, Pamela wonders if Bart sang about this place during King Dashford's reign. Uh, let's get a closer look. Hmm, okay, I can measure those. Alter panels. <laughs> Working and let me switch somewhere. We're waiting for Paimon to say it's not working. Time to go. Time to go. There's some coming from the center hall. I guess we'll turn off the sandstorm. This our room. Maybe. This shouldn't be our room. Why not? Maybe. I don't know. Well, according to this stone slate, we've obtained King Dasher's consent and reached our room. Uh, but this place doesn't seem very much like our room. There's only this friendly huge device. One feels that our room should be more delicious, more beautiful. Well, we don't know what Aru is. I mean, this place is kind of nice looking. Yeah, exactly. It should at least be filled with greenery like Summer City. We're in the desert. Uh, at a time like this, another look as the sounds like clean hurt. Uh, there's a new line of words there. After flying across the river in falcon form, one must Burn the embers of the sun at three places using feathers. Uh, only through this may one obtain the mercy of Awahmar and ascend to Aru. Okay, so we have to ascend. Uh, Aru is probably on top of the pyramid then. There's more. Paimon's getting annoyed. Why can't King Dashford just finish explaining without stopping? Uh, this is getting exhausting. Uh, don't forget how Teresa was malignant. The think about the treasure. I'm so tired. Let's head back. Think, don't forget about Teresa. And that's right. We're here to make the Sohel guy apologize. Yeah, visions best motivation. Uh, anyway, it it isn't time to head back yet. Let's find out 
how to burn the embers of the sun. Ooh. Where's the entrance? Where the come from? Time to go. Time to go. Didn't even notice that was a little bit around. Hey, Spider Kidash is Mouse Leon. Seven one. Oh, I can't go to the edge. I wanted to see. Okay, I get it that I'm on top of the pyramid, but I. Hey, I never tried to climb this one. Um, but we are above that. Order guide you. I hear everything. One with the bars. Clouds high. The birds solidified. Can't put the wings. The wind strike. Let's nip that in the butt. Positions. This is order. Gather! As one with wind and cloud! Yeah. 
Win strategy. I'll approve you. Not my strength. Stabilize. I will have order. In drown. Win strategy. Let's nip that in the butt. This dance is for you. This is order. Gather. Clouds high. The bird. Then. Okay, we were about that. Oh, I didn't expect the whole pyramid to cross far. Was it daytime when we came down it? Eh, I think we can forgo the lost and found report. Okay, and that is right in the middle. Okay, now we can go to the edge. Time to go. Got a nice look at that. That area will probably be released before. Uh, Fontaine. Oh, yeah. come on. I want to check here. Maybe there's something. Uh, there's one there. Yeah, up here there probably won't be because I may not be able to go all the way up there again. If that is enough responding boss, there's really no point. Although, yeah, there's the chest. I could have just left it there and now uh, opened. So maybe we can go back. Yeah, what was really the point of that shifting on the pyramid? It could have changed a bit more shape. Maybe it is not exactly as it was before, but I can't really tell the difference. So, look at the desert. No, I refuse to escort you in the desert to the desert. But the mausoleum of King Dashford, which has remained the same for centuries, has undergone an unprecedented change. You saw it just now, didn't you? I need to make a record. It's also my first time seeing this change, however, the sage has prohibited researchers from entering the desert without his permission. And not like those rash young researchers, I've dedicated years of studying in the academia. The answer is still no. Hello, long time no see. Seems like you you are having a nice time in our village. Huh? What are you two what are the two of you doing here? I did say that I wouldn't pursue the matter, but you should stop going around deceiving people. I'm getting old, so my time is way more precious than yours. Besides, I have more important business to attend to. So if you would excuse me, wanna enter the desert. When I get closer to the mausoleum of King Dashrath. No, not at all. I'll never go against the sage's restrictions. I just want to... Wait a minute. Both of you are all covered in dirt. And you are holding a suspicious tomb slate. Did you just return from the desert by any chance? Are the changes uh, in the mausoleum of King Dashrath linked to you? No, we're frauds. I knew it. Wait, where did you get this stone slate from? So his eye wide open as he scans the slate. Due to various reasons, practically all the records of the later periods of our Mars civilization have been lost. 
Even those that are occasionally dug up are just fragments. I've never seen such a perfect stone slate. No, it's not only me, even the sage may have never been in such a miracle. You were, you were calling us frauds just a short while ago. Did you really enter the mausoleum of King Dashford as Tirzad's paper described? Nope, he's a fraud. Please stop joking. I've always thought highly of Tirzad and considered him to be and considered him the future of Bahumana. I'm not the least surprised that he wrote such a wonderful paper. Wasn't he kind of a bad scholar and didn't publish anything worthwhile before? Uh, besides, he received a gift from the desert. The assistance of an outstanding traveler like you. Oh, what a sudden change of attitude. It's like he's taking on a completely different character, just like the source there star tellers of Louis Du. Could you allow me to carefully inspect the stone slate? I'll compensate both of you for it. As for the moment, as for the amount, uh, before that let's go someplace quiet so I can take a closer look at the slate. Uh, I completed the quest, but now we have a new one. Okay, let's continue. I thought it would take it way longer. Hey, well, that it's a lot cooler here. Mind letting me see the slate? I examine the slate, alternate between frowning and marveling. Hey, you are spending too much time in that, on, on this. I'm not trying to commit to the text to memory and skimp on our pay, are you? Sorry, I was just so fascinated. This is my first time seeing writings like this in Discoveries. Mm, some of it looks like a construction log. Mentions Aru, but there's no way to know if it's in any way connected to Aru village. Uh, too bad the records say little more. But this discovery is certainly worth several pages of writing. Thank you very much. Here, as per our agreement, we should be thinking of Tirzan instead. That's right, if you weren't trying to prove to that correct, we, sh we wouldn't have found this late. You're right, Tirzad's the one I should be thinking. Yes, indeed. My next step will be to find a bigger collection of primary materials, but that's going to be difficult without going into the desert. Oh, I have an idea. If I had the time, please hear me out. So, how are you thinking? The sage prohibits any researcher from going into the desert. Now, I wouldn't dare challenge the sage's authority, but I'm sure he never prohibited the giving of gifts, right? Gifts? What are you going to give us? Something very precious, my archaeology notes. To be honest, I ventured into the desert more than a dozen years ago, but didn't find anything special other than noting the locations of several potential ruins. I believe it's fate that brought me back here to make your acquaintance in these ruins. So I want you to have these notes. I'm trying to... I get it. it. That isn't against the rules, but I'm afraid your actions would... My actions? I'm simply presenting a gift as a celebration of a friendship with English the Big Hero and Paimon the Little Hero. Isn't that more than fair? I suppose. It's fair indeed. The world of researchers is too, way too complicated. He could have just come right out and said that he needed our help. Instead, he had to go through this whole charade. Um, they aren't blocking people from coming back and forth from the desert, but the researchers are. Uh, if you think, if that's Paimon, he's just afraid that the big guy over there would rat him out to the sage. It's because your world is too simple, Paimon. Oh, Paimon, you actually understood. He must have his reasons. Oh, you actually understood. Of course. He was just short of writing, help me, all over his face. Uh, if we help him now, I'm sure he'll get, we'll get loads of rewards. 
Let's take a look at what's written on Soho's page. Oh, that's too much. That's too much text. Day 32. It's been a month since I first settled in the desert. During this month, we have recorded everything that could be discovered outside the mausoleum of King Deshert. But what's the use of that? Any potential talk has already been written about. When I saw that people were writing extremely niche and incomprehensible papers like the aesthetic preferences of structures in the short civilization, an analysis using the pyramidal inclination of the mausoleum of King Dashert as an example. I knew that the only way to find a breakthrough would be to enter the mausoleum itself. But we couldn't enter the mausoleum. Everyone's patience has been worn out, not to mention we're running out of drinkable water. I'll give another day. Hopefully, during our last attempt, things will go according to what the legends say. Spring water will burst forth from the long dried well, and the wielding barrier will finally be shattered. <laughs> 34, I return to our village. 5, I can't just live empty handed. I have to think of something, or else I become less in stock. 38, we discover new ruins, but whenever we try to Try getting closer, a transparent mechanism pu would push us away, stopping us from proceeding further. I am absolutely certain that Dashford created this mechanism to cover up evidences of his tyrannical autocracy. Maybe he's talking about Kain Such. Uh, we discovered three more of these transparent ruins. Three more? Okay, maybe I haven't found those. Which makes them foreign in total. Total. However, we still haven't found a way to enter any of them. I'm going to record their location for now. <coughs> their locations for now. It feels like some kind of illusion. Perhaps a vision is necessary for cracking the case. I need to look into that. We have arrived at the dune of Karos. Uh, the cone shaped ruins that look just like a smaller version of the mausoleum of King Dashred are located here. I guess I'll call it the Tomb of Corrosus for now. Although it's a lot smaller than the mausoleum of King Dashred, I still find it hard to imagine how Dashred enslaved his people to build such a structure. Disappointingly, we have encountered the same mysterious power as last time, keeping us from entering. Now, not a, I will not, I will not waste any more time. We will head further into the desert tomorrow and see if we can find the Fable Oasis. 46. The archaeology team has been attacked by a group of Eremites. They call themselves Tutmos. I've never heard of that name before. Their leader were two young men. Their leaders were two young men. One wanted to kill us all, but surprisingly the other young men stopped him and let us go. Uh, to, uh, this is probably Probably before, after, after the girl was born, but before her mother died, because they were still together, but the Jabrael was, was already nicer, and she's, she's older than 12. Uh, they seem like fanatic believers in Deshret, so they are nowhere near decent. Nevertheless, I hope Dashford will always bless the young man, uh, and that his axe will always remain sharp. I have no choice but to return to the academia and face their ridicule now. But to be honest, compared to the mockery, having no improvement in knowledge is more painful to endure. In the boundless force of, force of knowledge, I am but a snail that has only just crawl onto one of the branches. I've also been thinking the sheep in a nearby area often disappear for no reason. I've never seen a sheep in this game. Uh, the locals believe that they were swallowed up by the rock formations. So they named the place Lame Devourer Rock. Those ermines suddenly jumped out of from the rocks and disappeared into them. If we draw a parallel between them and the disappearing ship, the answer becomes very straightforward. The two most members may be using a specialized technique to hide themselves. 
or perhaps there are there's a hidden cave somewhere. Anyway, I'm going to write down the location first. If I ever return to this place, I'll hire an Eremite from Tutmos as my guide. Uh, looks like he's been having a pretty hard time. <coughs> he explored the area around the Mausoleum of King Dashford for a month without obtaining any results. He didn't want to give up and found uh, the transparent rooms. And then he found something a lot smaller than the, key, than the Mausoleum of King Dashford. The Tomb of Corusus. Finally, he was attacked by a group of mercenaries in a place called Lemdevour Rock. Oh, even though he went through it all, he still wrote that compared to the mockery having no improvement in knowledge, it is more painful to endure. It's not like a completely different person. Yeah, it seems like he really was in need for the knowledge back then. But I'm also a little moved. From that perspective, it wouldn't be an exaggeration for him to call this a precious gift. Let's visit each location mentioned in his notes. If we find something decent, let's bring it back as a gift to him in return. Ah, oh, but that's the what I just read. Okay. <laughs> uh, no. Ah, okay, no, there are. Okay, I think this part will take a little while, but... Okay, this is... Have I already got the Japanese special desert? No. I... Not yet. <laughs> I did already. Okay. Okay, I wasn't expecting to have them done now. Let's not check. Ah, uh, they're done. So they're pointing here. Doing a carousel. Okay, so it's probably those three. Actually, I don't think I fought this one already. I don't think I entered here. I entered here, I entered here, and then exit here. Enter here, exit here. And this one. I don't quite remember if the entrance was well here or if the path down here would lead to the back here. I think it did. Uh, so the visible barrier stuff was inside the. the get inside there, that would be walls that we need a clearance. Okay, so yeah, okay, I, I did that off screen, but it's just basically following paths. We are back to finish special the desert, yeah, let's see, we explore the transparent ruins. Uh, you went to the transparent ruins, did you find anything? Of course, be prepared to be thunderstruck. We recall the exploration and give me uh, three stones. Ah, oh, okay, there were some stones that I was finding in chests at times. So, King Dasher did indeed withhold a secret thing behind that an old force. I shall get to the bottom of it. This is. How could it be? This be? Uh, you look pale. Did you discover something terrible? No, sorry, they're not exactly terrible. The writings on the stone slates look complicated, but they are actually records of leave requests. In addition, the record excuses are not any different from that of the young scholars today. Oh, it's a good thing that I failed to find a way to access the transparent ruins back in the day. I imagine that I would have been quite lived. Anyway, I must thank you for bringing the slates back. Perhaps I should go ask around about these excuse people making most that. That could be enough for me to write a paper. Time out from busy, busy schedule on the evolution of the perception of, of days in different societies. 
Uh, since the sage didn't spe specifically ban travelers from entering the desert, yes, you may go ahead. Okay. For the Lamdevor rocks. Um, you weren't in any danger, were you? Uh, not that I doubt you could handle any situation, even if you did encounter Tutmos. You encounter explosion in the rocks, So there is a secret base after all. No wonder Tutmos still managed to rob me despite all the precautions I took. What a bunch of ignorant fools. They claim to worship King Deshret, and yet they randomly throw such important relics around. Inexcusable. I must thank you on behalf of the Academia for getting such a valuable... Uh, uh, what's with the sudden frown? Did you run into something difficult to decipher? Just the opposite, really. It's a lock point. Perhaps this link will be more valuable to those from... Our avatar. We, we don't know what each school is there does. I can already imagine what titles they will come up with. On the relationship between the development of rhetoric and the progress of civilization. Okay, the last one. To enter the Tomb of Corrosus. It's a miniature version of the mausoleum of King Dashrut, just like I said, right? So, any new discoveries? You're kind of exploration, game sounds late. Sounds like they didn't find anything special. I guess size isn't the only difference between the two locations. And as for this late, what is it? What is it? It has so many words, so it's got to be valuable, right? From what I can tell, it's an ordinary fable of features that feature some animals. Uh, how can this be? But that's okay, I can still squeeze the paper out of this, albeit a short one. Uh, the Retreat of the Sheep, a preliminary study of environmental change in the desert. Well. Now that the three ruins have been fully explored, I can finally put my thoughts to rest. Well then, to celebrate the strengthening of our friendship, I shall prepare more gifts of gratitude for our big hero and little hero. We scratch our back, we scratch us. you're welcome. But I think he should co-write with Jirzad. And the other guy was... The other guy also came here to search the desert and he wasn't able to do anything. Uh, it's nothing really, plus we found lots of treasures. A treasure based on our, your notes. So, how's your paper going? The papers... Yeah, even though I've collected enough materials, I no longer depend on churning out volumes. It's a breakthrough I'm after. I must still go into the mausoleum of King Dashford myself. But the sage said... Yes, I get it. It's always about the sage with you. And just gripping, that's all. What do you need a breakthrough for? With the change in the desert, shouldn't the sage allow more expeditions to check what changed, why it changed? And now it's open, people can check inside. What do you need a breakthrough for? To become a candidate for the next sage, of course. To outsiders, the difference between a researcher and a sage is that of a small fruit and a larger fruit. In reality, the gap is even greater than the difference between a hitherto and a slime. Hey, what's up? Those two are completely different things. How are they different? The difference is that they are completely different. Uh, the sages control the Akasha. No, the Akasha is down. So, they virtually have all of us researchers by our throats. They could make or break us with just one word. Not anymore. <laughs> uh, so many people have labored and thought over papers. Some even as old as me. 
we give up our dignity just for a chance to be deemed worthy by the sages. Therefore, I must become sage myself, or all the suffering I've endured will be for nothing. I'm sure you'll understand if you were a researcher. No, I don't think Ignus will be more like you in the notes. Notes. Yeah, remember what you wrote in the notes? Compared to the mockery, having no improvement in knowledge is more painful to endure. Well, I wrote that. Uh, the experiences I had are indeed true. But if it weren't for your reminder, I would have never looked at things from that perspective again. So you've forgotten all about it. It's good to remember a thing again. Um, Ignus, this is a bit abrupt, but there's one more favor I like to ask. Uh, do you want us to look for s more stone slates? No, 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 I have enough stone slates. I just feel like reading my old notes again. Please allow me to take them back. To take back their college notes I gave you. I'll prepare something else as a gift for you. Sure. Thank you for all your help, and may your travels be smooth. Uh, also, thanks for reminding me of a time when I was younger. It's a pretty good feeling. Yeah, it's been a while since I used Noel as well. Uh, I think I got her max out. I didn't do any wishes today yet. Let's go for more time. Another banish. I think this is the third time I got banished during this banner. Six more days. Okay, I'll save some pretty much for wishes during next week. And I maxed out Bennett. Not that I use him. But okay. Um, but yeah, I was just about to finish this one and stop playing today. I was mostly getting things for clearance so I can finally explore everything. Oh yeah, let me check one more thing before finishing up. Now I think I should be able to get inside there again. There were chests and stuff in there. So I must be able to return. Time to go. Solidify. <laughs> oh, maybe I could be far. I had the symbol already. Check my map. I think there were things I couldn't get before. And there should be a new chest here. Mess with that for a little bit of work. Maybe it's working already.
Okay, that one isn't working. Man, I'm gonna be spoiled if I ever change the, my main character. Uh, I use that all the time. Okay. for quite a while I'm back a while back uh, Kokomi I only tested her but I I didn't really grasp her mechanics and stuff uh, I'm getting a bit spoiled with Tainari as well because of this charge shot Who uh, says there so are benefits to a life of wandering? Can we sit? We can sit. Oh, come on. We, it's just we don't say the poem. We won't die. Uh, Time to go. Or it would be nice if somebody's body stayed here. Well, right. I think I'm gonna be in here. Hey, thanks for stopping by. Huh. <laughs> 